I mean, I, I can do um, no, two. Nice. So I'm a big like uh, classic films guy. I really, I'm a big Sidney Poitier fan. Mm -hmm. He's like a hero for me as far as an actor. Uh, the Defiant Ones. Oh, so um, good. Yeah, with uh, with Tony Curtis is uh, is a seminal film for me just because of the issues that it tackled as far as like race relations and then getting to see Sydney be so powerful in that position and even today you don't see that as like as often as you would like to in a lot of uh, films feature films mm -hmm. um, and then just the like the bond that they had that was so much stronger than any of kind of like the politics that were surrounding it it just it was such a hopeful film it was such a powerful film it has mm -hmm. such a strong message so that's like one of my favorite classic films but I mean I'm, a, I'm a, like a film I'm like I'm, I'm like a film guy so like I mean I'm anything Brando's ever done I'm like mm -hmm. a huge Huge Brando fan, and then um, for modern stuff, uh, The Matrix is like my. Okay, like, I watched like, it the other know, day. Just the first one. I watched it on a plane. They were making you fun of me. Finally, wait, that was your first time. Come yeah, guys. On. Yeah, exactly. I gotta complain about this. Just the first this. one, not the other two. Yeah, it's, number one. I don't one. even think of it as a trilogy. It's a single standalone <laughs> film, and it and it just blew it's my a mind. Uh, so yeah, those I those are three I can it. mention. I forgot that, to tell you that. that. I'm I'm proud we'll of you. We'll talk about it. We'll will talk, talk about it after the interview. Yeah, Malcolm X. I was about Malcolm to say X. that to you. Sorry, I'll, I won't steal anymore. No, Sorry. no, no. Go ahead.